So you're the one, huh? I didn't even think that you would agree to see me. Wait, sit your ass up in the chair when I'm talking to you. You may act like that with your homeboys or even your mama, but you're not going to sit here and disrespect me. Act like I don't matter. This is why I'm here. Look at him. Look at him. Look at my baby Justin. Look at his face. Look at what you stole from me. Yeah. Yeah, he has a name. He has a face. He has a future. He had a future. A future that you stole from him. And why? Because he looked at you sideways at a party? You just don't get it, do you? You and all these other little boys are in here serving time for killing your own. We're out there protesting, protesting Black Lives Matter. But you could take whatever Black life you feel like whenever you feel like it. I just came here to tell you that I hope you rot in here. <laughs> I hope you never see the light of day because of what you took from me. What you took from my family. You can go to hell for all I care. Mm -hmm. Yep. to see you before you got out. I heard you got saved and got your master's degree. Seems like you did some growing up in here. I, I did a little bit of growing up too, you know? These past 17 years have been uh, a real journey for me. Kind of been a journey for you too, huh? Yeah. I, um, I spent about 10 years hating you. But, um, the problem with that is I put my life on hold. I lost my husband for a time. I just, I couldn't get past this, you know, I couldn't let it go. <laughs> if I had a gun, whew, that's I was 
dead set on destroying you. But then life hit and I got cancer. And I got scared. I was like really scared that I was gonna lose whatever life I had left. That hate was eating me alive, literally. So, I got so much needed help. I went to counseling and I went to chemo and my cancer is in remission. But most important, I was able to forgive you. You killed my son. You took the most important thing in this world from me. And then you sat there so smug almost 20 years ago. You weren't even sorry. Oh, no, no, don't put your head down, okay? You, you have done your time and you are all the better for it. And I forgive you. Thank you. Hmm.